Hi, this is Sedis. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to combine roots. Um, what I want to do is have this field uh, generate a root on this, combining it with a refill root for this sprayer to be refilled when it's uh, going empty inside a field. Uh, so we'll go and refill and go back and it will be able to continue spraying from where it left. So we need to first set up the, the field. So we'll go to the field marker that we created in the last tutorial. That was the marker for this field. We are going to the question rig. And this sprayer is, let's see, 24 meters in working width. So we'll crank the working width up to 24. Go back a half meter so we have a little overlap. And we will start at this corner down here. So we will need to use see this is north west so the, uh, it must be southwest corner that's the corner down here we want to go in the east direction north east and we want uh, this one to return to the start of the route if it's empty so we'll use this one Set it to yes and generating root. And we'll save this spray. And then we will reset the course. And I will back up here, right? around here. Now we want to record the, the refilling route, so we'll just start course of recording. And try to refill the station. And we are almost here, so let's go over here and try it past it. So you'll see up here that refill sprayer is marked and we'll be able to continue. If you miss it, just pause the recording, delete some of the waypoints and continue from there again. Uh, like I showed in the tips and tutorial, the tips and tricks section I made. And we here. Uh, I'll just stop here and save this refill. Then I want to reset the course. And now we will combine these two routes. And it's easily done. Just go to the manage course courses. Uh, and we want to load the field first and not uh, the refill route. Always load the field first if it's possible. Uh, so load the spray field and we then we'll add the refill to the end of this field. So that should be about it right now and we always set already set on fertilizing mode so let's just try driving it. Uh, yeah, okay. We'll just continue. We 
reason why I did this is because we don't have anything in the spray area yet, so we will drive into the field, drive around and go back uh, to refuel now. And it's refilling. And it should go to the start point now and unfold. Hmm. Well, I think the reason for that is that it, the sprayer was empty, so it couldn't, it didn't start at the start. So it drove the first part of it, returned, and refilled. So we thought it will start here. So we'll. Just drop the driving back up to the start. And drive course again. And it should do as it's supposed to. So I'll force fast forward this uh, until it should um, refill. If it going to refill, I don't know if I don't think I, I'm not sure if this spray is small enough to actually be empty on this field. Uh, well, we'll see. when it's fi finished uh, before it's finished the field so I'll just stop here and I'll cut out the section where I'm em emptying uh, the sprayer and then I'll continue afterwards and we almost empty um, so you'll see that it actually stops on unfolds the sprayer and drive back and refill and continue from the point where it was. So let's see if yeah. and it's unfolding. Well not unfolding, folding. trying back for the refill one now. Um, I would suggest when you're making the refill one, uh, recording the route, refill your sprayer uh, down at the station uh, so you don't have that little glitch I made at the start uh, when I started uh, the route. to the start point, go to the start point and go to the last known working area we were at. So I'll continue from there.
and there you have it. So, see you at the next tutorial.